Artificial intelligence is making its way into classrooms and bringing concerns about students cheating on homework and exams. A new AI program called ChatGPT is tempting some students to use it for homework assignments. News 10's Justin Kent spoke with educators about how they'll handle the new challenge this school year. Artificial intelligence has long been a staple on smartphones with helpful assistants like Siri or Alexa. But what if you could ask those virtual assistants to write you a cover letter, speech, essay, or even finish your exam? Well, this is now a reality with AI programs like ChatGPT. When I ask you to do some writing, it will be for you to practice something. And you can use ChatGPT to skip practice. Some universities run the students' papers through a program that looks for signs that the work was done by AI. Michigan State University professor Bill Hart Davison said that detecting software may not be very accurate. It could be easy to catch if you just prompt it simply and turn in whatever it spits out. Yeah. Right? But if you then revise that a little bit, then what? Not everything about artificial intelligence is negative. Eaton Rapids Superintendent William DeFrance says this is something that educators need to embrace. I believe that we're going to see this used in a lot of positive ways going forward. DeFrance said this is a tool that teachers should use, and he hopes that educators in his district don't focus on the wrong thing. I don't want to have teachers spend a significant amount of their time playing the cop on the work. DeFrance said these writing AIs can also help grow creativity. He remembered a speech that was given at a recent graduation ceremony that had used lyrics from a Tim McGraw song to make something brand new. You listen to the speech, I mean, it was, it was really a cool speech for kids. And then when I found out he used Chad GPT, I'm thinking, okay, I think I think we're at a new level now. And that was Justin Kent reporting. Michigan State Professor Bill Hart Davidson did say some teachers might go back to paper exams and handwritten essays to help prevent cheating.